Hello everyone, this is Serious Trivia. Welcome back to another episode of our legendary Tron Warlord Dobe Let's Play. We continue for episode 13 from turn 84 in the spring season of 207. So, uh, in between episodes, I used a little bit of diplomacy through a lot of promises to make Jungle like us so that we can confederate him. The reason for this is because he has our wife and I would love to get her back. So we turn him from negative 400 something to positive 200 something and we get a very willing confederation and we should have some armies in control of areas that we can now attack out of the Shangyong region on Cao Cao's territory. We can actually grab Ma Teng as well. It's possible. 63 versus 50 once we get the diplomacy fixed. And I believe... Yeah, even this is possible, especially if we get Ma Teng, his vassal, to become our faction so that, you know, in a sense, he loses even more uh, military strength since he lost a vassal. We can technically take control of everything in the north. I don't know if I want that. At that point, right, Han Sui loses his coalition. We probably confederate him as well. So if we want to chain confederate, we can actually grab all the northwest. Um, doesn't seem like there's a looter faction on the map. There could be. We just haven't met them yet. It's a uh, option. Not a very urgent one. I just wanted her back. Yes, you dear. Thank you for carrying our book. What happened to the other item I gave you? Maybe we got that one to stay. She can't really be part of the leadership right now because we put in someone who has outsider uh, plus the minus four. 5% from her uh, trait, so she's outclassed by her. But in the future, we might get something back and we might get kids, who knows, now that she's finally back. We'll forgive her. Yeah, cool. Let's see. No negative traits, right? Okay, good. Young Ren. Let's see if we want to keep any of them. You look like someone we will just fire. Yellow dragons. Ah, it's only one, though. Is that a good enough reason to keep him? I guess it is. Alright, so we're gonna clean him up. Grab night battle. Looks like we have, what, two armies? Three armies in the area. One who just took this, most likely. We can colonize. There we go. Let's see who we have here. Oh. Xiang. Sure. Yan Liang is over here. Okay. Zhang Wu, of course. We can. That's eh, fine for now, I guess. I'll take this. We'll take this. We have a second stack. Ooh, garlic leaf. We'll hold on to that. Okay, so does Maton really only have one county that's level one? That's very sad. If we do confederate them, do we get the Emperor? Hmm, that might be an added incentive. Right now we're a 19 army count, a lot of low quality armies, but we just basically got three stacks to attack Tsao from a new direction. And we should invest in another stack, like a legit one that we want to use. We want to summon it here, I think. This opens up the most options for us. So we probably start with a strategist choice. We have quite a few. Oh, well, we have Fa Zheng, who is actually kind of under leveled. Uh, maybe Tai Yan comes out first. She has a more experienced stack already. And then we want someone on the front lines, preferably someone more experienced. Maybe Han Fu can come out. His unit's not super great. 
but we don't have anyone with good frontline units. Oh, I believe he is... Well, he's not Brand or anything, but he has Imperial Sword Guard. So maybe that'd be our frontline. And we ran out of seasonal deployment. Bandit Spear Gain, no good. Archers, no good. But Imperial Sword Guard, definitely very, very good. Uh, we have access to a lot more White Feather now. Let's grab them. And then we'll get a Cavalry General for them next turn as well. What else can we do? Oh, we have to clean up the fighting here. That's where we ended. They're going to push and catch up to them. And then finish off their fishing port. Our previous fishing port. Oh, grab firebomb for sure. This was a temporary summon. He can go back now. He lost his other two friends because they got knocked out in the fight. They are not dead. They basically will bounce back. So we'll just have this army take care of this and go over here and just hold them down. We have moved everyone else, I believe. Pretty much. Yeah, they're on the edge and that's where they should be. Should have just given them the garlic. Ah, oh, 45%. They're fine. Alright, things look pretty good across the board. I don't think we had to push for that confederation. We have our faction council, so industry boost sounds good. Don't want to do this against them because we're probably going to conquer it. Let's fatigue them. About to attack them next turn. Get a trade dealer into yet. They just have a gate pass, which is good. This is also good. Hmm. This is forever. Southern Jian'an, sure. Not the best, but it's fine. Ah, uh, Saihodun is still a viable kill target. Let's keep him alive. It's fine. Our income because of the industry boost goes to 44k. Phew. Yeah, I don't think we're going to be spying much. We only have five food, which is a bit rough. That has to do with Hanjong being over leveled. Alright, we're going to bring this down real quick. Don't think we need this. Okay, immediately our food goes back up. Looks like this is in ruins. We're going to have armies marching towards it. Ooh, I mean, we could give them a legit force. This looks like an okay army setup. Alright, let's deal with... Yeah, we still care a lot about corruption reduction. I mean, we can dream. Maybe one day we'll have the palace building, then this will be a powerhouse of a peasantry income. Ah, uh, sure. There's a little bit of commerce here.
want to convert this first. Oh, we're actually out of money. Okay, we spend it all. The 44k rolling in next turn. Let's see how Tall responds. We're about to clean him out in the south, and we're gonna take these two soon too. And then oh, Gwen is gonna oh He is asking us for a territory if we give him no. He doesn't understand the situation. He needs to be giving us stuff. They're chasing after us, that's fine. We left this for them to take. I could have lowered the level down, actually. Yeah, you can see all their armies coming out. Good thing we reinforced this one with going use force behind, but we took a bad delegate here. I'm debating a retreat. I assume they don't have enough movement to siege Guan Yu. And even if they do and they force a fight, it would be a defensive siege, which would be slightly better for us. We do lose mustering, which hurts a little bit. Our base replenishment's not too bad. Let's see if they have enough movement to keep. I mean, they do see. Ooh, triple army. Ah, Guan Yu and the Jin province. Not a good match. Well, we just had a pretty epic defense, and they're still part of the defense. Okay, so that's good, I guess. We didn't expect so much resistance. But if we crush them here too... Much like the Kuei Path, that's like six armies that's crippled. Yeah, if we knew this was the situation, we wouldn't have delegated the fight. We would have fought it with Guan Yu's army and fought it pretty cleanly. Now we might have some issues. Okay, our reinforcements on the other side, which is good. They have siege weapons, which is bad. It's highly ranked settlement, which is sort of good, sort of bad. We have to, oh, they have walls are open already. That's not great. Hmm. Right, they have to take this path or go all the way over here. The reinforcements, not that many people. Yeah, I feel like they can just arm up here and kill the cavalry. Salsa's army has a fatal flaw. Not enough range unit. I might sacrifice our boy to get the data heal. Get him to go out and duel. Oh, we can heal. Hold on, we can delay this. He has he has a recovery. It's very, 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 very slow. We at least burn that up. Hmm. 
they're so weak, I almost don't want them to go and die. Maybe better off to just send them away and have them run to a corner. Let's turn this off and turn this on. That way we kind of lock our tribuches in and they have to take a much less pleasant path to get to us. We have some very, very unhealthy cavalry units. They're useful. I think we should keep them away from danger first and have them come out at a more opportune moment. We really don't have a lot of things to use. Alright, pound that. You guys get out. Heal, 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 heal. Alright, they're shifting away from the tech. We can shift a little bit too. We can't hit that. Yes, we can. Good. We want to at least burn up the forest that they're in first to make sure they can't just sit there and keep hitting us. If this gets stranded far enough, we can go after it, but it might not be worth it. It's not going to hit much. In a siege, multi-bolt crossbow is pretty useless. Another volley. Alright, you guys are here. What can we do with you guys? Generals go inside, I guess. Actually, maybe generals go outside. Barely any unit here. And what can they do? Drive them inside. Go to the square. I feel like we can't hold the square. That's going to be the problem for this fight. They're going to just try to take the square. I think we hit it enough. Let's, uh, let's change some target. Let's go back over here. Oh, you two maybe go snipe the tribuchet for us? We're healing, we're healing. This thing's pretty useless. But we need to wait, we need to wait. Probably gonna wait until they cluster over here and see if we can get some good values with our shots. Swing them up a little bit. 
Oh, you might be looking to get a duel. Yeah, they took out the tower, it's fine. Their unit's gonna be wasting their shot trying to hit us on top of the wall. The wall will shield us for a lot of that damage. They haven't even fired a shot yet, it's completely useless. This is why Trebuchet is just so much better. Okay, I feel like we can make a go for it, at least distract them as well. No one wants to die, right? Because Boy can kill them. We not shoot the one who has turtle right now? Then they switch target. All right, here they come. We are full health now. Setting cavalry. That's what we don't want. We just need to get them out alive. We have a source to heal. Let's go, go, go. Yeah, drawing their attention is fine. It's time to micro this, though. Hold on. We might have a chance to collapse the wall and kill their generals, too. I know we can't. We got them. We got them! Wall collapse. It kills everything near it, including generals. Okay, okay, she didn't get out, that's fine, that's fine. We, we just killed, like, their best generals. Alright, we'll pound this opening. This is blocked. They're defending here. We'll light it up when we can't hold it. We got an easy kill. Time to kill the range. Might be kind of suicidal. Hold on, let's see if we can do this. One, two, three, four. Before they get close. Alright boys, no formations. Pull it back, pull it back. We do have a bonus against cavalry, so it's not too bad. But they're coming through pretty fast. We have to defend the center. That is our weakness. Alright, we did smash into their range, but they have quite a few spear units here. I don't know how many of our guys will get out alive after this. Hidden Snake is not a problem. It looks like we can pull it get out. We have the speed. They are all infantry here. And their own unit lit up the fire, so it's all good. Wait, is she willing to duel someone like... No, no one wants to duel Guan Yu. Reasonable. 
see if they can actually disappear first and then will reappear later. Okay, it's okay, we're good. They used up their shots, so it's all good. I'm gonna just go back and capture some of these again afterwards. Okay, I know there's two cavalry units here. Maybe we should just wait. Are we invisible first off? If we are, we can stop going. Okay, we're good. We're good. He can't shoot us. He, he won't see us. I don't think he's gonna make it through all these towers. Just like running through over here is gonna kill him. Alright, we're back in. Looks like we're probably not needed here. We'll go kill that. I mean, there's no reason to die, like suicide. Once they're in, we can do our thing. Right, they are coming kind of how we predicted. Right, let's just leave them alone. The tower is going to do more damage to our generals than them, but we do get heal, so I'm not too worried. Right, they would just get picked off by the towers. I'm, I'm sure we're okay. Two nice little turtle... Actually, two circles would be better. Alright, now we can come out and hit that. Don't over chase. Yeah, they're just gonna die there. It's okay. Maybe we can help kill this, and then maybe help kill her. Nice easy kill here. this first.
All right, he's gonna kill her on foot and then maybe kill her on foot. And then we have like a gazillion towers to fight here. Okay, let, let them shoot us a little bit. It's not that many units. We're just gonna get away. Wait for something more vulnerable to show up. Hmm, the infantry cluster here is annoying. Can we kill her before infantry get involved? Alright, we're gonna go knock her out. Where's our other... Alright, looks like... Got her. Alright, get back on your horse, you did your job. Now maybe try to recapture some towers for us. She backed off, we back off. Sorry, you guys are on your own. There seems to be a rivalry internal for them for a damage boost, so maybe we should just kill the other one. Huh, why horse fellas? Hit her a couple times. There we go. Now comes the final wave of the big attack. We can't run around because of the cavalry. Maybe we can get in from here. Infantry are slower. He's rested up now. Why are they going this direction? They're invisible. I mean, good luck running through all these towers. We're gonna ignore that. Alright, he's in. Let me squeeze through. Maybe it's better if we go for this. Mm, if they're just going to stand under tower fire without capturing the tower, then we let them do that. They still have more reinforcements. We 
We can use this gate to enter and then kill that. Although, it's a bunch of cavalry. Let's, let's hang out for a little bit longer. Yeah, if they're just gonna stand there and get killed, then do it. They're firing at us, aren't they? Alright, we might have to take care of the White Horse fellows. Those are annoying. Yeah, they're getting killed. We don't let them capture, though. Ooh. Got caught up. Mm, can't micro everywhere. Just want to capture that back. Alright. Lower health target. Well, you're the healer. Don't get killed. Let them finish the fight. just standing here to deny them the capture. Seems like they're just going to attack from here. We're going to try to clock that lane up. Yeah, if they're so close to the towers, we'll just let them die by themselves. I don't know how useful this group is. There's so many spear units. I don't know who they would actually fight. Okay, so what we could do is Guan Yu could dismount and go in and fight, and when he's low, he can mount back and then obviously get healed. Because Guan Yu's got some uh, pretty good hits and a good slash damage that's on repeat, and I think he causes terror. So, yeah, we break people real fast, real easy. Yep, chunking, chunking. Rapid Tiger Infantry. Is that Yuan Shu's unit in the mod? Now, here comes some more action. Guan Yu, we might need you elsewhere. Get back on your horse. They broke them. We might have a problem here. They're not capturing right now, so I think we're okay. They're just basically running through the gauntlet of towers, which kills them. We kill the infantry so they don't capture. New group. More spear unit. That's the last group, though. That's the good news. You should actually just sit back. Let's put you with uh, with these boys. Let's call you guys two. You're, you're a heal station. You don't want to duel? Not even my son? Is it the unbreakable? Why did all Tsao unit get some sort of unbreakable? This is ridiculous. How come we have none of that? Let's 
Let's go. I will kill you all. We can probably move one over, given that no one's actually attempting a charge here. And they can. We just need one. Turn this way, Gwen. Turn this way. Uh, that's not bad. It's a good hit. Yeah, there's no targets for them, unfortunately. Yeah, he's just gonna stand here and get killed. They're done too. We'll get our horse onto the the next group, which I think is this unit here. Which we can charge. Now there's so little here. I don't even think we need this. Let's do a slow here and then we're moving over there too. Horse, pick him off. Oh, he's dead. Never mind. We'll help over here. We might actually get an army loss, even though they're alive. Where did their general go? Ah, oh, he's right here. 6v1. Can we beat a tiger cub? Tiger cub has what? Unbreakable, let me guess? Ah, does not have unbreakable. Okay. Color me surprised. Any any spear unit we need to be watch out? No, there's no spear. Charge in there. Give them your best. Oh, some terror. They're coming up, but can they actually make it and survive the tower to capture? We'll see. They failed. No one needs to guard this. No one's coming. They only have 12 more minutes. I don't think they can have, even have enough time to even try to beat us here. So we might get a draw, which feels kind of bad because I feel like we're winning this. We find infinite heal bailed us out from our poor delegate in the last fight. Going, we need to hear. Yeah, stupid general's gonna come in and stand there again. Ooh, quite a few people here. We're just gonna recapture, see what they do. Cavalry might hurt us quite a bit. We'll see. Nice of you stand together. We have Splash. Alright, we'll recapture this. They held beautifully. go after that. Alright, just gotta stop the capture. We don't need to be here for longer than that. I 
Alright, son. Mission for you. Go capture that. Get into some weird formation and get cleaved. Terror is spreading. Army loss? Minus 77? We got it! We won. They're breaking. Uh, we should chase, actually. They're all armies still in front of our face. We definitely, definitely don't want them to survive this fight. Oh, you're, young. you're not on a horse, are you? Get back, get back, get back, get back. Okay, we go chase someone. Don't just stand there. Tower is still going to continue to do some damage for us. There's still so many of them. All right, we're getting our fair share of defensive siege battles for this campaign, thanks to the mod giving AI ridiculous amount of armies despite not having the money for it. But it, it has given us these fights. So if you enjoyed this type of fight and this imbalance, then definitely the mod for you. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna catch up to any other unit, maybe a little bit more here. That group is gone. But yeah, I think we crippled three more armies. Uh, the towers inside in this area did a lot. Having a higher level province definitely helps. Or commandery. Heroic victory for us, see how many we capture. For a moment there, I thought Guan Yu, you know, might go the wayside of uh, history and die in the Jin province, but not our version. We come out full health, or close to full health. Oh, no, we're actually full health. No one touched us at the end. That's why there's Rapid Tiger, because we have Yuan Shu's daughter. They got confederated as well. Makes sense. She has an item. I'm going to spare her. Nothing. Siege weapons. Uh, if we, even if we execute, I think they just replace her. But I still kind of want to execute for the chance that they don't replace her. Take that. We need to upgrade these units. Oathorns are not great. They're back at Quay Path. I mean, they're crippled. How do, How are they going to... I think we can delegate that for a win. Especially if we have night battle. And this one's kind of crippled too. Yeah, Tsao definitely on back foot here. Oh, they finally sieging for some land. A little bit late, I think. I think Huang Gai, we put him at a position where he can just go in and fight them. Oh, going his daughter first visit. Will Druga down show up before we win? He lost his drunk trait. Good for him. Weapons and armor. How good. Silver. Okay. Yen whose army show up. Oh, it's bad. It's so bad. 
烈火燎原。啊，此城甚善。They don't have any levels on any of their territory. What is going on? No development for the bandits. Feels like a bug by the mod. Like one could be like a little accident, but two. Two feels just just like something's wrong. I feel like it's it's a, it's an issue with the AI mod for bandits. Right, they do have a full stack here, a little bit annoying. They are on the run, they are here. We could just dump three generals here and I think they can just defend. We cannot reach this, but we should still go over here. They're being very annoying by being here because we have to kind of defend that and this. And we need to help over here. They never sent anyone here, huh? Way over leveled, gotta reduce it. Our food is gonna be crashing after this. Minus 23 food. And they're selling. That makes sense. Peasantry industry. We're just gonna way, 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 way drop this to very, very, very low tier. So give me two slots over. It's Imperial. It's ridiculous. City. Yep. This is much better. 44 food swing. It's a good army. This is a crap army. Even if they stay here, I don't think they can do much. I feel like it has to be them. Well, you had quite the fight. We might have to stay. Wow, we can drag 1v4. It's basically 1v1 plus 3 scraps. He comes in as a tired reinforcement. Lady Wu? Hmm, might be worth it. Might be worth hitting them. Their units are wrecked right now. He can't... Yeah, we're going to hit that. Just not now. They're still chasing us. That's fine. We steal this for free. I don't know if we should hold that Hefei. I mean, I know I want to cause more problems. It's so, like they should they should absolutely march deep. They could get here and wait. We could upgrade this in a rush situation. The garrison's not gonna be very healthy, but they can't reach us in a turn. It's gonna be a two-turn thing. We can give them a strategist. They're going to go down, take the fishing port, and maybe offer some help with this. I believe this might be Yemba who's only army. Stare out for now. I mean, we don't have a very conventional army for sieging. No siege weapons. So if they want to sally out and fight us, I think that might be a better situation for us. Time for you to die. Shoyan 
天下大义。They're sieging us. Thing is, they're sieging us with a really, really bad army. So they just basically prevented us from replenishing. I should try to kill this side. Like actually wipe. Oh, if we just execute all three, the army disappears. No? Yes, if we employ all three, it disappears. If we kill all three, he still has retinues, he can still replace the generals. But anyways, they're done. We got a roar, even better. And we just chill right outside. So they can't stop our replenishment, which is all that's important. And then Shisia can jump over next turn. It's just easy kill. And then they're on their way too. Speaking of people on their way. On their way. And they're helping us siege it. Good for them. We will heal up. Um, I don't care about the quality of the army. Should I confederate Maton just for that stack? And... Eh, probably not. Alright, Guan Yu's gonna have some smackdown over here. They're defending over here. We need to set up a defense here. And then also maybe launch a counterattack later. Strategist. Jung finally gets the run. A little low level for our taste, but it's gonna be okay. We'll pick a... Uh... Oh, speaking of picking a vanguard, hold on, let me... Let me fight this first. We could night battle, actually. We don't have to... Go this hard. Ah, eh, let's go this hard. We have the siege weapon for this, and the cavalry are decently healthy, magically. And of course the generals are tip-top shape, so shouldn't be a problem. Once we beat this, we can put the other army in the settlement, and then find a good vanguard for them, so that we can decide on the vanguard for the other army later. He's just gonna go kill everyone. As long as we don't get dismounted, not scared of anyone. Hmm, can't fight here. Cavalry, we don't want that. We might have some problem getting back on our horse. It's right over there. We might have to fight out of this. Tower is actually going to help us with friendly fire. Oh, oh! Someone wanted to. No, please do us. It might be because our terror was activated, so extra stats scared them off. Yeah, there we go. And the second kind of turns off, they get fooled into fighting us. And then once we start winning, the damage and melee evasion kicks in again. 
and we build up this as well. Although, how to get him back on his horse now just became infinitely more difficult. He's calling us God of War, how nice. And he's not, not anywhere close to being a match. Yeah, we can choke when he's gonna win that. Come back here. Come back here. There we go. We can get closer to our horse. It's right there, I think. Where's our guy? He's right there. He's going to get a taste of God of War. Oh, he's cheating. Oh, he has abilities. Pretty much right off the tree line. Not bad. Looks like all the enemy reinforcements have arrived on the field. Oh, Lady Wu wants to fight? Maybe? No, cannot duel. She doesn't have a stat over 100 points? Like her instinct stat? I guess not. I guess she just has authority. And uh, you're dead too. And uh, you guys want a piece of this? Yeah, yeah, they're done. Get our horse, get our horse. You guys still want to fight? Yeah, that's right. Siege weapons going. Are we back on the horse? Yes, we are. Let's kill her. Just one charge and she's done. Time your swing. Time your swing. Oh, got shot. Swing. Swing. Uh, not the units. Not the spear unit, especially. We don't have to kill her with that health. She's useless. Get in snake. Too many spears here. I don't even want to go in. Diamond charge. I'm gonna try to just avoid it. Mm, more cavalry coming after us. We're gonna leave. No point tanking those. Pretty good opportunity here. Take advantage of it. Or just miss. Okay, that one hit pretty decently. We got her. One more general down. Okay, we can kill these scrappy ones. That's really all they have? We kill, what, two generals in a duel, she's the third, so they're the full army, and then in the last battle, only that little girl escaped with a little bit of health, and we just wiped her. Okay, that's the situation. Uh, 
Our cavalry start stretching the field. Then some leverage on some of these uh, more healthy archers later. But they're so delayed, a lot of the spear, that we can't really do much there. Here we're tanking those. Right, I'm gonna go. You should actually go too. go for that. We can go for this. kind of hitting their own guys, sort of. I mean, we have more than them, so it's not great for us, but it's kind of the situation we got ourselves in. All right, not unbreakable at least, but a lot of morale. Quick route and run. Took a lot of pressure off the front, but uh, not a lot of good openings here. Maybe after we kill this, we can come over here and hit some of that. Or we can stay and fight. I'll go chill. There's too many spear unit, really. Okay. Yeah, maybe... No, I don't think so. Let's, let's back off. Dad, I'm here. Well, he's like, does it look like I need your help? Dad, I'm here. All right, we don't want to get swarmed by elite spearmen. Let's get them out. Pull them away. They're pulled away. We're pulling some of their archers out of position. Including the two here. The infantry right in the middle of things to charge them out. Young blood. Okay. Okay. 
Can't get inside here, that's the big problem. They have too many... Too many stupid spear units. Do maybe something like this? Okay, we somehow broke through. And we got inside of their setup here. Alright, Guan is gonna dismount and kill this thing. Yeah, we're just gonna have to fight in there. We can't do much about that. You will manhandle all of this. They routed. Stop going there. Can't control him. There we go. Why can't? Yeah, there we go. Why can't I click there? Get them out of there. Why you stays in here? You pick up this guy. I got them out of there. Almost ours. Here we go. Can't believe we don't have army loss yet. There we go. Alright. Why you showing his strength? And we can even back their army up on friendly territory to heal after this. Which will be perfect. Hmm. Feel like we should spare some of these. You're not going to get any better. Let's keep four armies on the field. I think it's going to be better for us. They basically come back and set up an encampment. I think we're going to end our episode here. Lots of fighting. Basically, we have defended our beachhead and we have spread our army, harassment army around. We have a new harassment army for me over here. There's some minor headache back over here, but not a lot of big, not a lot of big armies. There's one army here. I'm not happy with this force here. I don't know what to do with them right now. We might end up recalling them or maybe resetting their unit for something better. 
but with them right here, I feel like I shouldn't do anything. Just like leave them alone and let them catch up and it should be all good. They will hit this and then go catch them. This army could possibly come down depending on what happens here. We're forming a new army here, we're forming a new army here. We have two more army slots to form more armies. We could potentially form another set here to help out with the Hefei situation. Should say I'll be attack we'll be counterattacking over here very soon. One, two, three coming out. They're gonna hop into the water after a dojo. They're gonna sail over here, grab this. We have to land, but we can get through the shallows and then attack through here, and then it'll be onto the capitals. I, I think it's just a matter of time now. Tsao Tsao's forces are destroyed, and we have more forces moving up by the day, and sooner or later, we'll have the capitals and get the victory. So, hope you guys enjoyed it, and see you all next time. Bye!